guys. Okay, so I got my order from Ken Starts. I'm really excited. And I'm really surprised, like, how she packed them all into this box. Well, after I saw how she did it, I was like, oh, okay, it makes sense. So I have my cute little hair clip in. I just got off work. My hair looks horrible. It's like 105 degrees here in PA. Crazy. I know. So, okay. So it came in a small flat rate box like this. And I had to like rip it open because she actually taped it nice for me. And I got six packs of tarts. Just a little, you know, just to try them. I heard they're awesome. Um, so hopefully I really, really like them. So first up we have cotton candy. And she has them stapled shut. And you get three tarts for a dollar fifty, which is really cheap. And then shipping wasn't ridiculous; it was like six dollars. So my total came out to like I can't even remember, but it was really good. I think I only spent like fourteen dollars. I tried to keep it like under twenty because I was like, well, what if I don't like them? And you know, that was a waste of money. Plus, I'm still trying to go through all of my Haley's Family Sons, my Sweet Fixations, and my Gracie Joe candles. So, I'm trying not to, like, rip this bag. And if you notice, I'm a little red because I went to the pool yesterday and I burnt myself. So, yeah. So then, they were, like, just a little soft. I, I popped them in the fridge for just a couple of minutes. But they came perfectly fine. Mm, this is what I smelled when I opened it. I think. I'm not getting much um, scent bro, but I'm sure they'll smell fine. They were in the heat, so I'm going to let them set for a little bit. But you get, again, three little tarts for $1.50, which is an amazing deal. And they're, there's nothing like they're just, whoop, they're just tarts. There's nothing... Um, fancy on them or anything like that so then I guess we'll keep with the pink theme because I got like five four of my packs of tarts are pink so the next one I got was pink sugar cookie yum love 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 pink sugar cookie and then um, as you could see on there her website is www.tartcandlesbykim.com and I will link that in the info bar below And you know how I told you that I don't order, like, looking at a scent list well with hers? I looked at the scent list because, um, I just wanted to make sure that I was getting some scents that I, like, liked. And again, this one is a light pink color. Oh, you can tell this. One's kind of funny looking. Yum. Right away I got the sugar. Mm, definitely going to be burning that. I just had in my warmer, I had going um, Strawberry Noel from Haley's Heavenly Scents. Oh, it smells so, so good. So, um, I took that out and then I'm going to put one of these in. I can't remember which one. I'm going to try first. <laughs> um, so the next one I got was um, Lick Me All Over. Which I heard is really, um, girly and, like, fruity. I don't know if I remember that right. But I wanted to try it because I heard it was a fan favorite. And another fragrance that I really, really, really want to try is called Bite Me. Um, Erin Making Scents loves that scent. And I really want to know, like, what it smells like. And I just ripped the bag. Yeah. Oh, these are, like, a pretty, pretty, um... Dark, dark pink color. Mmm. Smells familiar. Look at a mint. <laughs> um. I like that. It has sort of like a clean scent to it, but then you get like a sugary, sugary note. It smells like. 
It kind of reminds me of like laundry detergent, but like one of those fancy scents, like downy, like whimsical flowers or I don't know, some flower patch. I don't know, like something different. I don't know. And this has like sticky stuff on it. I don't know why, but that one's sticky. All right. And next one I've never, ever, ever tried is Sex on the Beach. So, excuse my horrible looking nails because I tried to paint them and I thought it would help me, like, not bite them and enjoy it. Yeah. I will always have short nails unless I go to get them done by professional. interesting. I can't quite describe what it's supposed to smell like, but maybe when they, um, they, like, set or, like, cool down, I'll give them all, like, another sniff, and I'll do a review. And I'm going to be doing a second video today because I need to do a review on some of the candles I've been burning. Amazing. Okay, so the next one I have is lemon sugar and Aaron making sense raised about the scent from Kim so I want to make see what it is and I just ordered this fragrance actually for myself to try and make some tarts and um, cupcake soaps in so oh mg yum it smells so good Mmm, really citrusy. And then you get like those undertone of like vanilla. Mm, and it's a gorgeous yellow color. Like, so pretty. Mmm, I like that. I probably will be burning that today because I am in the mood for something like to like wake me up because I'm just so tired. But I turned my tart warmer off because I had it on since this morning and then I went to work for four hours and I came back and I was like I give it a break and but I just learned that one I got it from Yankee a while ago and I always thought it was a 24 watt well it's not it's an 18 so I was like oh, okay <laughs> okay so the next one I am opening for you guys is coconut cream pie and you can see like the oils down there, so you see it's kind of melted. But I love anything coconut, so I'm hoping that I will like this. Because I'm thinking it has like a sort of a bakery note to it with the crust and stuff. This pie has crust? Yeah, I was right. Mmm. I like this. Cold throat smells amazing, so I'm anxious to see what it is hot though so I'm probably I don't know it's a toss up between the lemon sugar and this so out of all of the six packs that I've got I would say this is my number one number two and my third one would be pink sugar cookie you can't go wrong. And I like that you can, like, hold it back here and you can, like, sort of read it. But you don't have to be like, oh, man, this is what I got. Like, you know. Yeah. Okay. So, I'm definitely going to be doing a review on those. I have been melting so quickly lately because I'm trying to get through, like, everything. But I give every tart, like, a day or two so I can, like, really, you know, see, like, how well it gives off self throw. So... That is everything I got from Kim's Tart, and I will put all her information down below. And if you have any questions, please let me know. If you'd like me to review any of the fragrances that I got, please let me know as well. And I will see you guys in my next video. Have a great day. Bye.